Hello, thank you for joining us again on this channel dedicated to assistive technology research and development. This is another video that will feature Tom Fowl, a blind engineer at the Smith Cattle Eye Research Institute in San Francisco, doing several trial runs of the ice free barcode localization and scanning module of Shop Mobile, our mobile accessible uh, shopping system for blind and visually impaired individuals currently implemented on the Google Nexus One smartphone. The only sensor the system uses is the phone camera, and the trial run will consist of three products a Pringles tube, a toothpaste box, and a tea box. It's probably down low. Unlike the previous version of uh, this algorithm that used to operate on still images, uh, this version operates in uh, video mode by grabbing frames uh, from the video stream and uh, trying to locate uh, the barcodes, well, possible areas where the barcodes might be, and then uh, decoding them. Hmm? Okay, I'm going to change sides. Okay. It's a good, uh, good strategy. Tom is uh, being very systematic. He is uh, going through each surface of the toothpaste box, uh, trying to find the barcode. I should add that uh, Shop Mobile grew out of uh, out of our previous research on Shop Top, a wearable system for accessible blind shopping. Now this shopping. narrower side, I assume I can get a little closer. Well, we got one more side to try. Too fast. Okay, well, let's give it the bottom. Mm -hmm. I shouldn't have to move for that. I'm just aligning. We don't think so. Okay. Mm -hmm. Other end. Yeah. It doesn't have a very, it's not very tall, so I shouldn't need much. It, I would assume it can see about half the vertical height of the box at once. So while Tom is scanning for the barcode on this T box. I would like to take this opportunity to thank uh, Bill Crandall, John Braben, Tom Fowler, and Ben I Beery, lost track. You gotta be careful about that. and many, many yeah. other you can't really folks tell. at Smith Gettowell I Research Institute in San Francisco for giving me this opportunity to run these experiments. Yes. Yeah.